Hey guys, so I haven't done a follow-up video-ish in a couple days and I have like a 40 minute drive probably coming back from my parents' house and I thought I would just do a video to update you guys. Kill time makes my life easier. Um, so yeah, um, today is Wednesday. I think it's the 2nd of October, which seems really crazy. My birthday is next month, which seems, I don't know. I just feel like it should be like summer still. But anyways, um, so this is technically like my third, kind of like my third week. Um, so yeah, today's Wednesday. So tomorrow it'll be three weeks from surgery. So I kind of always forget like what I've told you, what I haven't. So I'll kind of just go over everything. Uh, like I said, tomorrow's three weeks. Um, last week on Wednesday, I started my puree diet. Um, so I've been doing that for a week. It's been way better than the liquid diet. I mean, I still don't have a ton of choices. Mainly I've been eating cottage cheese, soup, uh, refried beans, mashed potatoes, and gravy. Um, some yogurt. Uh, and I don't want to say like do what I'm doing because I'm not saying that it's the right thing. But to be honest, I am not doing good at getting my protein in at this point. Um, I, I've said this a million times, but I despise all of the protein drinks. I literally just tried a new one today. Um, I don't know if we're supposed to have it, but it's the Special K, um, 15 grams of protein and strawberry. And I probably drank like a third of it. Obviously I don't love it. It's not as bad as some that I've had, but it's not good like where I wanna eat, eat drink, the rest of it. Um, so again, I'm driving, so I'm trying not to look at the camera a lot. Um, so yeah, I've been like trying to keep track of everything and put it in an app on my phone called Berry. It's like Berry Tastic. But yeah, I definitely have not been meeting my protein goals. Um, which does suck. Like I know I'm supposed to, I know it's important. I don't want to lose my hair or anything like that, but it's just really hard. And I feel like once I get on like food, food, I can eat what I want. I'm definitely going to focus on that more. Like even if I have to just mainly eat meat, you know, all the time to meet my protein, I would rather do that than drink a drink. <laughs> um, so yeah. So physically, I feel pretty good. Um, like nothing really hurts, like my incisions don't really hurt. The only thing is like there's one area, pretty sure it's where my stomach was removed. Like if I bend over far or sometimes like when I'm getting up, it'll hurt. But that's the only thing that really hurts. Um, incisions don't really hurt, I'm trying to think. Um, one thing is I have had been having heartburn a lot I don't know if it's because of the surgery because I hear like a lot of times people have like issues with heartburn after the sleeve I don't know if it's that or if it's like a mix of the surgery and what I'm eating I'm not really sure um but yeah um so I I don't know if I mentioned this so I'm sorry if I'm repeating myself but I did throw up I think it was last week for the first time um and it was because I had tuna with mayonnaise so I like tuna and I like tuna with mayonnaise <clears throat> and we're allowed to have it. I got like the light mayonnaise, mixed it up, might have already said this, but, um, and I had it, but I instantly was just like, oh, it didn't agree. I felt miserable. I'm like the type, I will try anything not to throw up, but I had to get it out. That is the only time I felt sick. Um, I do notice now now like this week more than last week and the week before I'm really tired a lot um I mean before I was like sore and I was tired but like I just feel like now I just don't have as much energy in general um so yeah my plan just keeping it real my plan was to go back to work this week 
but the more I thought about it, I was like, you know, if I can physically, or not physically, if I can financially afford to just take one more week off, and I'm hoping, <laughs> fingers crossed, we'll be fine and I didn't screw myself, but I was thinking, if I can do that, I'm just going to take it, like, just to chill, um, you know, I kind of, I don't know, like, just, like, switching stages, like, on Thursday, I'm probably supposed to go to, like, soft foods, all of that, I just feel more comfortable trying everything at home, that way, if it doesn't agree, or whatever, but mainly, I just, this is the only time I'm ever going to be able to take, like, a week off, or weeks off, um, and not get in trouble for it, so I was like, might as well take advantage of it. Um, and I mean, it's FMLA, I earned it, it's not like I'm doing anything wrong, I did have surgery, I'm not lying. But, yeah, so today, today's Wednesday, I'm going back to work this coming Monday, which is crazy. People ask me, like, are you bored, are you tired, like, of being at home? Not at all. Um, I'm not bored at all, I feel like I've been doing stuff every day, um, I do like to like get out like once a day and like do something but I'm definitely not bored I don't feel like I've been I've been gone and doing something every single day so it's not like I've just been sitting in the house for weeks at a time um so yeah I'm not really sure what else to say um yesterday I went out to eat for the first time I went with my mom um she li they live like 50 minutes to an hour away so like when she comes and they live in the country so when she comes to Lafayette like I know she wants to go out to eat I know you know and I didn't want to like not let her do that so um we went to Mexican she loves Mexican food but then I also knew that I would be able to get like refried beans and cheese so when we got there I got a water which I'm not supposed to oh this is another thing okay I I don't think I've ever brought this up. So, one of the biggest things they say of, like, the gastric sleeve surgery is that you cannot drink while you eat. You have to wait 30 minutes before eating and 30 minutes after eating to drink. I have a really hard time with that. Like, I literally am just feel like I'm so thirsty when I eat that I almost don't even want to eat if I can't drink. Um, so I got a water because I was super thirsty at the time and I just took, took a couple sips. So like, you know, I wasn't like miserable while I was eating. And it didn't affect me any physically. I know I'm not supposed to do it, but just keeping it real. Um, so I was going to get just like refried beans with cheese on it. You know how they like just melt the cheese. But I seen that for like an appetizer, they had like refried beans and cheese like queso cheese and I got that and let me tell you it was freaking amazing it was so good I love queso cheese so to just have like the beans with the queso cheese in one it was so good um I bought the leftovers back and then I ate some last night and then I ate some this morning um mashed potatoes and gravy I've only got so far from KFC but when you only have liquids for like three weeks and you eat something, it's amazing. Um, but anyways, anyways, anyways. So I thought it was going to be hard to go out to eat with my mom, but it really wasn't that hard. I think mainly because what I got was really good. I enjoyed eating it that I wasn't like just staring at her all jealous while she was eating. Um, but that was the first time I went out to eat. Me and Star haven't went out to eat or anything. I guess that is really it for now um i just want to keep like doing follow-ups and everything but if you guys have any comments questions leave them below and i will answer them the next video